It's really nice to be in the Junction Triangle today. Today we're going to check out the Drake Commissary that opened up a couple months ago. I'm a big fan of the Drake on Queen West, so I'm super excited to check out the Commissary and see what they have to offer. I heard they do a really sick brunch, so I'm super down for that. I'm usually not in this area a ton. My buddy lives further down there in Little Portugal, so I've explored that a little bit, but not really this end of the Junction Triangle. It's really nice. There's lots of green space, so hopefully we can explore and find some cool things today. All right, guys, we just walked into the Drake Commissary. And right off the bat, we have this adorable photo booth. <gasps> How cute. Just walking into the Drake now, and it is so, so cute, guys. This is like your ideal, like perfect cafeteria that you wanted in school. Ugh. First impression is that it is totally different than the outside. The outside's really industrial and looks like, you know, it could just be any other building. But then you walk in and you have this amazing, like, living room space, which is awesome. And that painting is literally begging to be Instagram. It's so nice. I'll show you in a sec. And this is the little juice bar slash espresso bar, guys. Where they're making some great stuff. I just sneaked a peek at the latte menu and some stuff looks so good. I think I'm gonna try the maple almonds latte. I love almond milk and I love maple and fall just started, therefore have to. I make chia seed bowls or like overnight oats really often for work because they're super easy and I can just wake up, grab it, and like go. So when I make chia seed bowls, I usually make a salted caramel like banana one with like cocoa powder and some maple syrup and some majul dates. I would never ever think about putting pineapples and mangoes on a chia seed bowl. Like this is incredible and I'm definitely going to try and make it at home. I'm going to try is the operative word. <laughs> So Drake Commissary really is a one-stop shop, guys, and I mean it. Here are all of these different takeout things you can grab to go, like some good hummus and some pesto, some smoked salmon and stuff, which is awesome. And here they have little pints of ice cream, which is wicked. They also make their own bread here. They make their own charcuterie. Like, this place, I'm telling you. Okay, we're all set. We have our coffee from the Drake. And now we're about to go and check out this really nice walking path called the rail path that's right here. Perfect. It's a perfectly sunny, beautiful fall day. This is actually the ideal temperature always. It's like jean jacket weather, leather jacket weather, Enough that I'm not sweating while I'm drinking my coffee. However, getting a little shiny. We get these cute little red accents on the fence here. It's just super cute. Nice little nature walk in the morning. 